The exhibition that we're in right now is Skyscraper, and it started development in the year 2000. And at that time, we were working with the Port Authority of New York and New Jersey to develop the content behind the exhibition. And one of the buildings we were focusing on at that time was the World Trade Center. And as we all know what happened on 9-11, we were still very much wanting to talk about the World Trade Center in some meaningful way. As part of the exhibition, we have two pieces. One is the, one of the main foundational columns of one of the, of one of the towers. And the second will be in this curved uh, circular stand. And that piece of steel shows the amount, the tremendous forces that were, were played on the building during its destruction. And we're talking about the National Science Foundation and the U.S. government's studies to determine why the buildings collapsed and how they are making skyscrapers safer. Oh boy. Tell you the truth, I don't know yet. Yeah. It's gonna be trial and error. I'm gonna try to bring it in, set it on top of the rig, and then drop it in a hole. If that doesn't work, we're gonna try something else. Not really a well thought out plan. Usually you're not putting a monument up, you know, this is something, a monument that's, um, you know, a lot of people died over there, and you, you like to do something like this, but then you think about the, what happened a few years back, and it's, you know, sad, bittersweet, I guess you would say, something like that. It's tough. The important thing is the symbolism and having the I-beam there, uh, you know, not forgetting what happened to us that day and uh, trying to learn from it and move on.